So those are some shots of your university, and I hope they bring back some happy memories of your time here. Now, the main reason for making this video is to record your graduation. Today, you join the graduates of the university, and at the moment, those are about 80,000 in all. Moreover, they come from all countries, and they're now spread in all corners of the world. So this is a university, not just a university of the United Kingdom, but a university that is recognised worldwide. It is a large university and an important one, and in graduating from it, you've done well. We, of course, like all other universities in the United Kingdom, are at the moment under some pressure. Society is wishing its universities to change, and the University of Manchester is no exception. So continuously, we have to move forward to adapt to what is required and to abandon what is no longer required. We believe we're doing that. But there are one or two things that remain constant and can't be changed. We, when we educate our students from this university, are very keen that they should be able to do various important things. They should be able to marshal fact, develop argument, and above all, I think, have a regard for the truth. And we hope we've done that as far as you're concerned. But enough of all that. Now on to the video of the graduation itself. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to welcome you to this ceremony for the conferment of degrees. The degrees that will be awarded today are the culmination of many years of hard work and are the recognition of high academic achievement on the part of the graduates. And each of you waiting to be admitted to your degree can be justly proud of what you have achieved. But I'm sure that you would recognise, as your teachers recognise, the importance of the support and the encouragement that you have received from your family and friends. And that is why the university values these congregations so much. Today, we have an opportunity to share with your parents and grandparents, husbands or wives, our common pride in your success and to join with them in offering you our warmest congratulations. Now, for most of you, today's ceremony formally ends the period in which you have been students. And from now on, you will be applying what you have learnt, or you will be exercising 
your minds in modes of thought developed while you were learning. The great value of higher education is the training that it provides by the discipline of studying a subject in depth or in breadth, coupled with the need to be analytical and critical of the received wisdom. These days, there's developing a rather utilitarian tendency to classify courses into vocational and non-vocational, with the implied view that the first is good and the second is bad. But both have their place, because both can provide that rigorous training which is the characteristic of higher education. The distinction between vocational and non-vocational is in many ways a false one. The important thing is to have learned how to learn and how to combine imagination with rigor. The capacity to combine an open mind with a facility for constructive criticism will be even more important in the future. But for most of you, today's ceremony will not mark the end of your process of learning. Some of you will go on to study for further formal qualifications. But even if this is not your way forward, the pace of change in society is so rapid that you will need to learn and relearn many things in the course of your careers. Continuing education, professional retraining will be crucial aspects of your personal and professional development in the years ahead. And although most of you are now leaving us to go your various ways, the university will remain interested in your progress throughout your career. At present, the job market for graduates is booming and the career services job vacancy list is longer than it has been for many years. Some of you may have concentrated on getting your degree and are not yet settled into a course or a job. And if so, do remember that the career service remains available to you now and in the future. Today, you become members of two international fellowships. You become a graduate of this great university with its high reputation and historic traditions. And in becoming a graduate, you will be linked by ties of sentiment and history to those graduates who have preceded you and to those who will follow. And we very much hope that you will maintain those ties by membership of the convocation of the university. In addition, you will also become a member of that fellowship that consists of scholars in your own subject or profession a fellowship in which the subject is more important than the nationality of those forming the fellowship. Now this university prides itself on the fact that it is a full service university of international repute. Today we could see something of what that means. Sitting before me here, we have graduates from the Faculty of Law and from De La Salle College, one of our affiliated institutions. Now, whatever you've specialized in, you will have been taught by devoted scholars, men and women whose reputation and standing are widely acknowledged and modestly born. But even so, the faculty and the college are only part of what the university is. It's a university with large faculties of science, and medicine, and arts, and others. The breadth and the expertise which supports it are the very essence of what a university stands for. Perhaps I could just say a brief word of appreciation for De La Salle. The college has been associated with the university for more than 40 years, but that association is now coming to an end because the college is closing. We understand the circumstances that have brought the closure about, and we are sad at the necessity. We wish all the staff the very best for the future 
and are proud to have been a partner with them in setting high standards, both for academic achievement and for pastoral care. Now, in addition to the determination to maintain its reputation for teaching and research across the full spectrum of academic disciplines, the university is aware of and tries to respond to its responsibilities to the local community and to the nation as a whole. Through further education and training, industrial liaison, research consultancy and public service, we hope to contribute something to improving the society in which we all live. The country, indeed the world at large, is faced with major challenges. Problems of inequality and social injustice, of technological change, of competing ideologies and of economic uncertainty. It's our hope that through the education that you have received here, not only will you have achieved personal fulfillment, but that you will find yourself better able to make a contribution to the solution of these problems. Bear this in mind as we all offer you our warmest congratulations and our best wishes for your future happiness and success. Mr. Pro Vice Chancellor, on behalf of the Senate of the University, I present to you for the degree of Bachelor of Laws, Ian Anthony De Freitas. I admit you to the degree of Bachelor of Laws. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Thank you. Catherine Linton Scott. Well done. Eyal Baumgart. Well done. Timothy John Beasley. Well done. Elizabeth Ann Bottrell. Well done, Elizabeth. Samantha Jane Bocock. Well done, Samantha. Andrea Catherine Catherwood. Well done, Andrea. Lisa Margaret Conmey. Well done, Lisa. Jeremy Edwin Conway. Well done, Jeremy. Joanne Conyers. Well done, Joanne. Stephen Mark Curtis. Well done, Stephen. Thank you. Roy Colin Dunn. Well done, Roy. Thank you very much. Heather Eggleton. Well done, Heather. Jacqueline Kelso Evans. Well done, Jacqueline. Michael Jonathan Feeks. Well 
John Charles Gillette. Well done, John. Jonathan Ian Goldman. Well done, Jonathan. Donna Anwen Hughes. Well done. Thank you, sir. Anjali Jingan. Well done, Anjali. Andrew James Kerr. Well done, Andrew. Jeremy Paul Kosky. Well done, Jeremy. Hilary Sonia Leck. Well done, Hilary. Erica Ann Leho. Well done, Erica. Catherine Louise Lightfoot. Well done, Catherine. Fraser Charles McLennan Pike. Well done. Fiona Justine Montgomery. Well done, Fiona. Thanks. Helena Alice O'Connor. Well done, Helena. Jeremy David Parks. Well done. Thank you very much. Ian David Parsons. Well done, Ian. Catherine Jane Pears. Well done, Catherine. Well done. Anne Sarah Cleaner. Well done, Anne. Thank you. James Curtis Pond. Well done, James. Jessima Elizabeth Powell. Well done. Emma Jane Radovanovich. Well done, Emma. Thank you. Deborah Superior. Well done, Deborah. Thank you. Elizabeth Mary Saunders. Well done, Elizabeth. Thank you. Rasmita Shah. Well done, Rasmita. Helen Sarah Thomas. Well done, Helen. Vimal Tilakapala. Well done. Kirsty Elizabeth Wilson. Well done, Kirsty. Richard Jeremy Adelston. Well done, Richard. Lucinda Beverly Baker. Well done, Lucinda. Adrian Christopher Beasley. Well done, Adrian. Sarah Ann Beach. Well done, Sarah. Peter James Bibby. Well done, Peter. Jonathan David Bridge. Well done, Jonathan. Richard Charles Carter. Well done, Richard. Patrick Hugh Chisholm. Well done, Patrick. Paul Louis Alexander Colbeck. 
Rosen Paul. Paul Conroy. Rosen Paul. Nicola Kirsty Georgina Cook. Rosen Nicola. Nicholas Piers Courtney. Well done, Nicholas. Anthony Philip Dunn. Well done, Anthony. Thanks very much. Hila Rachel Iliad. Well done, Hila. Lee Alexander Fairbank. Well done, Lee. Thank you very much. Addison Justine Fitch. Brother Addison. Fiona Allison Flynn. Well done, Fiona. Thank you. Victoria Jane Foster. Well done, Victoria. Thank you. Joanne Frost. Well done, George. Satin Singh Gill. Well done. Well done. Timothy James Gittins. Well done, Timothy. Thank you, sir. Robert John Gross. Well done, Robert. Thank you. Catherine Ann Hendron. Well done. Thank you. Miles Robert Herman. Well done. Dominic Maxwell Jones. Well done, Dominic. Heidi Louise Jones. Well done, Heidi. <laughs> Benjamin Thomas Jowett. Well done. Ithney Mary Joyce. Well done. Thank you. Paul Chun Wai Kang. Well done. Kieran Andrew Kilpatrick. Well done, Kieran. Rosalind Costin. Well done, Rosalind. Sue Lynn Lee. Well done. Adam Michael Lee. Well done, Adam. Lee Shan Lisa Leung. Well done. Claire Helen Lipworth. Well done, Claire. Kevin James Lister. Well done. Yes. Kum Foy Mack. Well done. Thank you. Daniel Benjamin Marks. Well done. Elizabeth Marley. Well done, Elizabeth. Louisa Jane Martindale. Well done, Louisa. Lindsay Merriweather. Well done, Lindsay. Denise Karen Midgley. 
Well done, Denise. Thank you. Richard Mark Midgley. Well done. Simon Andrew O'Hara. Well done, Simon. Thank you. Roger Thomas Pickles. Well done, Roger. Nicholas David Rhodes. Well done, Nicholas. Yes. Mark Ellis Ridley. Well done, Mark. Lisa Jane Rauto. Well done, Lisa. Sakin Sue. Well done. Edward Jeffrey Richard Smerden. Well done. Thank you. Patrick Miles Thompson. Well done. Helen Turner. Well done, Helen. Rachel Madeline Turner. Well done, Rachel. Nicholas Peter Jackson. Well done, Nicholas. Thank you. Adrian Stewart Greenslade. Well done, Adrian. Thanks. Esme Ann Perry. Well done, Esme. And for the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Accounting and Law, Philip Howard Alvey. Have you have you invested in me, I admit you to the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Accounting and Law. Well done, sir. Ian Heron. Well done, Ian. Emma Elizabeth Marshall. Well done, Emma. Thank you. Sally Lynn Turner. Well done, Sally. Ian Robert Wood. Well done. Adrian Paul Butters. Well done, Adrian. Joanne Francis Louise Hale. Well done, Joanne. Mr. Pro Vice Chancellor, <clears throat> on behalf of the Senate of the University, I present to you for the degree of Bachelor of Arts with Joint Honours, Zoe Hodgkinson. I have the authority vested in me, I admit you to the degree of Bachelor of Arts. Well done. Well done. Catherine Mary Coop. Well done. Michael Andrew James Elliott. Well done. Joanna Ford. Well done. Thank you. Jill Marie Fry. Well done. Deborah Jane Graham. Well done. Thank you. Vanessa Diane Hansen. 
much. Well done. Fiona Mary Hare. Well done. Thanks very much. Jane Ann Hennessy. Well done. Nancy Barbara Hobson. Well done. Susan Irene Isbell. Well done. Elizabeth Ma Marie Jones. Well done. Michelle Marie Lundstrom. Christopher Francis Mannion. Well done. Thank you. Anita Maria Sadotti. Well done. Moira Bernadette <coughs> Scanlon. Well done. Deborah Jane Williams. Well done. Francis Caldwell. <laughs> Anthony Chamberlain. Well done. Christopher John Cullen. Well done. Tracy Denise Gallagher. Well done. Neil Duncan Hawkins. Well done. Rachel Jane Heathfield. Well done. Una Mary Hughes. Well done. Carolyn Jane Lawrence. Did he worry you then? <laughs> he did a bit. <laughs> well done. Jane Louise McAvoy. <laughs> well done. Thank you. Monica Hatlevitz. Well done, Monica. Thank you. Susan Pinder. Well done. James Simon Vincent Rippon. Well done. Thank you. Crispin James Treacher. Well done. Thank you. Susan Turner. Well Jacqueline done, Maria McEwen. Yes. William Jared Twybill. Well done. And for the de ordinary de degree of Bachelor of Arts, Susan Marilyn Aykroyd. Well done, Susan. Linda Elizabeth Clough. Well done, Linda. Elaine Greenhouse. Well done, Elaine. Paul Colin Hutchins. Hello, Paul. Christopher Thomas Marlowe. Hello, Christopher. Thank you. Elaine May Pauser. Well done. Stephen James Cairns. Well done, Stephen. Lois Elizabeth Flat. Well done. Heather Jane Fry. Well done. Paul McLaughlin. Well done. Simon John Potter. Well done, Simon. Valerie Power. Well done. Sarah Caroline Wilton. 
Well done. Thank you. Bridge and end. Well done. Lisa Mary Barnes. Well done, Lisa. Philip John Bateman. Well done, Philip. Paul Andrew Betts. Well done, Paul. Richard Andrew Biltcliffe. Well done. Anthony Breen. Well done. James Sebastian Peter Carson. Well done. Rory Clark. Well done. Elizabeth M. Clark. Stephen Thomas Connor. Well done, Stephen. Samantha Jane Cooper. Well done, Samantha. George Edward Corr. Well done, George. Rhiannon Davis. Well done. Catherine Angela Downey. Well done. Jane Errington. Well done. Timothy John Farrell. Sarah Jane well Featherston. Lisa Christine Fagan. Well done. David Nicholas Sisson Ham. Well done. Thank you very much, Lisa. Kevin Michael Hanley. Well done. John Morrison Healy. Well done. Timothy David Hill. Well done. Alison Fiona Holmes. Well done, Alison. Tracy Jane Hutchinson. Well done, Tracy. Stephen Gary Ivy. Christopher Johnston. Well done. Yep. Vanessa Jean Jones. Well done, Vanessa. Veronica Magdalene Lauren. Well done, Veronica. Simon John Lowe. Well done, Simon. Simon Peter Lunsky. Well done, Simon. James Lawrence McCraith. Well done. Thank you. Paul Francis McDermott. Well done. Catherine McNamee. Ian Robert Machin. Well done. Fenella Ann May. Well done. Tracy Jane Meredith. Well done. Jane Marie Monaghan. Ailis Mayor O'Malley. Well done. Michael Anthony O'Neill. Well done, Michael. Mark Ramsbottom. Well done, Mark. Christian Andreas Rosamond Riding. 
Well done. Thanks a lot. Jacqueline Marie Riley. Well done. Magnus Jason Sheridan Roach. Well done. Anna Margaret Joan Ross. Well done. Julie Ann Shields. Well done. Nigel Anthony Sony. Carl Frank Thompson. Well done. Caroline Michelle Towie. Well done. Elizabeth Wallace. Hello, well Elizabeth. Paul Lionel Warby. Well done, Paul. Samantha. Jane Yates. Well done, Samantha. Thank you. And for the ordinary degree of Bachelor of Science, Martin James Doherty. Well done, Martin. Christopher Hugh Gillett. Paula Jane Redwood. Well done. Fiona Jane Cheatham. Well done, Fiona. David William Lister. Well done, thank you. Anthony Norris. Well done, Anthony. Thank you. Munitsa Begum Rafik. Well done. Paula Elizabeth Backhouse. Well done, Paula. Alison Joy Cheatham. Well done. Wing Chiang Chiang. Well done, thank you. Jonathan Christian Duke. Well done. Alexander Douglas Hamilton. Well done. Jennifer Patricia Lamb. Well done, Jennifer. Patricia Ann McNulty. Well done, Patricia. David William Robert Marsh. Well done, David. Jane Morrissey. Well done. Joanne Elizabeth Roberts. Well done, John. Stephanie Ryan. Well done, Stephanie. Jean Mary Supple. Well done. Melanie Jane Woods. Well done. Last but not least, then. Yeah. 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 Can bounce some more, can bounce. Salvasit universitas nostra mancuniensis hoc precantes consagamus. So now you're leaving the university and going out to start a career in the world. We here in the university wish you the very best of luck. We're sure you'll do very well. 
When you graduate, as you've just done, you join a body of university graduates called Convocation. This body serves two purposes. First of all, it allows us to keep in touch with you, and we do this by the publication from time to time of a magazine, which we call Manchester Graduate. It'll tell you what's happening in the university, what's new, what's going on, how we're changing, how we're keeping up with the times. But we also want you, through convocation, or indeed by contact with your old professors and tutors, to let us know what you're doing, how you're getting on in the world, what your experiences have been. This is very interesting to us. Please don't neglect to do it. So now, the world awaits you. Good luck.